What's going on YouTube? Welcome back to a new series of duels on the channel against Mega Gaming and Legacy of the Duelist Link Evolution. If you are new to the Legacy Duel series, Mega and I are dueling with decks that you, the viewers, decide. Part 1 of the series is on Mega Gaming's channel, so if you haven't seen it yet, make sure to go watch it and subscribe to his channel as well, as we will be taking turns uploading each new match every week. You can also catch both of us live streaming on YouTube and Twitch, so make sure to follow both of us on there as well. Last week, the comments have spoken and Mega and I were chosen to play decks utilizing the level up family of cards. After somehow choosing the same deck with both of us playing Silent Magician, I walked away with the victory 2-1 to start off the series. For this match, Chaotic Neutral on YouTube have voted for us to play ritual themed decks and thankfully, I have faith we would not end up in another mirror match this time. If you guys want to request the next decks for us to play, all you have to do is comment below on the video and whichever comment has the most votes or other comments will win by the end of the week. Even though we are following a set theme, I have no idea what Mega is playing and vice versa, so let's get into the decks first and then the duels. For the deck I used this week, I decided to try something new, random, and unexpected. Neftis is something I played before the update at a pure level, but I decided to spice things up using a set of various engines used in the deck on some builds. Welcome to the true Fire King Neftis deck from Miss Valley. Neftis revolve around destroying their cards to trigger certain effects, similar to Fire Kings and True Kings in the hand, so the synergy is there for you to maintain advantage and land certain combos. The Fire King engine is barely a factor here, but using Island to search or having Arvada to protect can be a small plus. I did try out Garunix and more Arvadas, but one turned out just fine to make room for text. With the majority of the Neftis effect monsters being Wind, running the Wind Draco Phoenix at 3 was preferred over the Fire True King. It also has a nasty banish effect to land, and if you can link summon Armor Lyra with leftover Neftis monsters, you may be able to summon a VFD on your first turn. As with many Winged Beast decks, we are running the Samorg Link along with the Infinite Negate combo. It is quite easy to land since the Neftis Link is a nice setup already, and this deck can summon a bunch of monsters off Devotee and Baby Rock. The main combo with Baby Rock is that if you destroy it in the hand with any of the 100 card popping effects you have in the deck, it can resurrect itself to the field to give you another material for a Link Summon. It can also give you a Synchro Summon into Herald of the Arclight since all of our little Neftis worshippers are level 2. It's very disgusting to land. Extravagance was an option for the list but since we do use the extra deck a bit, Extra Foolish Burial felt better here. That's the deck for the most part though, you'll see it in action right after Mega's deck profile coming up next. Don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel and on Twitch and comment what decks you want to see us play next. What is up guys, it's Mega in the losing corner this week because yeah, we did lose to Joe because yeah, his build was kind of a little bit better than mine for the Silent Magicians. Today guys, it is a ritual and I've decided to run a, a Relinquished Invoked. I have made a deck on this, it's just that I didn't have time to make a, a Necro, so I decided to fall back on Relinquished. It's either this or Vandres and I decided to run, run Relinquished. He's like the OG ritual, um, or yeah, the OG ritual monster that likes to like, keep absorbing stuff. On top of that, we've got running some Kaijus to, like, tribute uh, points Mon. So we've got the Super... We've got the Prep Prep Planet Engine for the Super Poly because Relinquish plus any effect monster does go into our Millennium Eyes Restrict. We are, of course, running an Invoked package, so Alistair, and the reason why is because it just gives the deck a little bit more protection and a little bit more strength and a little bit more power. So Alistair, like I say, is a one-card combo that can go for... Invoked Mecha Bow, which is basically an Omnigate, or a Perka Trio. On top of that, like I say, guys, we are trying to basically just keep stealing our opponents. Mecha Bow can just keep banishing your opponent's cards as well. We do have cards such as Souls, which just allows us to pitch the Apprentice Illusion Magician for a free summon, and also it's a level 1. So that means you can go into Relinquished Anima of it, steal another one of Joe's cards, and also we can pitch our, like, dead spells in order to basically draw more cards to help but like recycle through the deck. Relinquish Fusion can also steal opponent's cards as well. On top of this, it can also summon a uh, our uh, Millennium Eye simply by uh, using Relinquish in the graveyard as well. So that's really great, guys. And of course, we've got Predator Plant for Tenor Conducts. It really does the same thing as well to help us go into our Relinquish or just go to Starving Bed and Fusion Dragon. And that's it for the deck, guys. Hopefully, we're able to beat Joe with this. Um, this, let's see. And... Yep, pray. Uh, let's hope and pray, boys. Uh, uh, yo, Joe, take it away. Um, everyone will I like, go for um, what you call it? 
Necros, and I just didn't have time to met the Necros, so I decided to fall back on this. Okay. Have you bricked again? No. Thankfully. Right. Right, boys, let's see full combo. Nah, this isn't full combo, but it, it's it's a combo. <laughs> it's something. Damn. I tried to do. Fucking Garnet. I tried to do like fire. I tried to do like fire King Nephis and because I like they both keep destroying themselves, but it's it's kind of hard to make a Nephis deck. You know what? Have at it. <laughs> <laughs> Are you sure, Joe? Are you sure? I'm positive. Go ahead. Right. First off, pre-preparation of rights, just like you. I add my ritual. I'm perfectly fine with not getting my monster right. stolen. Do you know what we're going to do here, boys? He's a coming. Alistair. You better OTK me. Uh, how do I OTK you with I'm this? just saying. <laughs> you better. <laughs> How do I OTK you? I can either go into Almirage or go into Mechabut. Neither one is going to OTK you and do 8,000 damage. Yes, Mechabuzz coming out first. You get the Alistair back to the hand. You got a whole bunch yep. of other relinquished shenanigans in there. And you know I've got relinquished in my hand. You do know that. Oh, use the Alistair and use the thingy. You know Mechabuzz coming down. Mechabuzz just gives you some protection. That's why I like him. It's a good thing I passed then, because I could I could get rid of him. <laughs> you can get rid of him. Spice. Right. Invocation lets me add Alistair back into my hand. You can't play that again, right? No. Right, I'm going to play the Souls. Oh. Play here effect to pitch the apprentice illusion magician. Summon Soulsy. Alright, play Souls as a brother D. I'm gonna pitch this. Draw. Right, well, at least that's another thing I could do. Add another Alice to hand, I suppose. Oh nice. Where is my call by the grave? <laughs> oh, what's going on here? He's a coming. He's a coming. Relinquished is here. Hmm. Right, to say that you can out mech a bit easily, that makes me say you've got a spell that can do it, or you've got a kaiju in your hand. No, I don't. I, I've told you this before. I don't run kaijus. I'm not you. <laughs> What's well, so, the like, um Patrick plays Super Poly, I play Kaijus. Is that how we're doing this? And I play Call by the Grave. <laughs> yeah. <call. laughs> For now. Yes. Okay. All right. All right. Here we go. Lightning Storm or Lightning Vortex? No. Okay. Okay. Ritual summon the level two. 
to summon a level 2. What? The spell can destroy a card on the field if I use a ritual monster as the tribute. Ah, very clever. So... You have something? Now you can summon any Nephis monster. No, 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 no. I was oh. reading what, what that thing does. Okay, what, do I, what else do I want to do here? Yes, Joe does have every single hand trap under the sun. Right, let's go! Spring my trap! Here's hope to God this works. Right. Millennium Eyes Illusionist once again to oh, steal... Works. Sacred Phoenix. Okay. Now, now, big bat. Now, now he's all powered up. Oh, what's that thing doing? Is oh, target another Memphis in the graveyard. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think I can do this. Uh, if this card is linked summon, you can't faint. Oh, add a level 8 wing beast from your dead to your hand, okay. Then you can add the ritual spell. Oh, that's actually very clever to add the ritual spell. Does it add the ritual spell from the graveyard then? Yep. Oh, I really don't know what I'm doing against Nephis, I'm not going to lie to you. Pop a card again. Stop popping my cards! <laughs> Okay, what do I want to do here? I can do this. Hmm? Oh. Oh, you destroyed the ritual to summon it? Uh... Hmm. Do I survive this turn? That's what I'm worried about. I think you do. Barely. Unless you've got something else. I think I do. Okay. I think I got an idea. If it was me, I would just destroy the Link, the link 2 mon- Or oh, destroy the level 2 monster for your mon- for your to yeah, uh, to destroy a Link Karibo. If it were me, that's what I, I would have done. I ain't got a clue what your freaking deck wants to do. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. Whoops. <laughs> oh, the damage! The damage! It's too much! Right, we're still standing. We're still standing. Unless you've got something more, we're still standing. Okay, so you have Alistair in the grave and hand, I believe. No, you added it back to the hand and then you discarded it. Okay. I think I got something. Oh, no, you searched another one with Magical Meltdown. That's what it was. I don't... Yeah, Joe, that's the question. You know that Nephis monster, that, that uh, the OG Nephis monster you summoned and I took control with Linkrushed? That doesn't summon itself next turn, right? Because it was destroying the spell trap card zone, but... I guess we're going to find out. <laughs> yeah, because I, I haven't got a clue if that thing resurrects or not. There is an out. There is an out. There is an out. I just have to draw it. Come on, God. Oh, you drew it, the Miss Valley Apex? Yeah, that's why that. Right, that God, if you're little... all. If... 
Our father, if you're in heaven, let me draw that card. Hmm. Please don't Kaiju me. <laughs> I wish. Actually, Kaijus and Relinquish is probably like a great idea. I have Kaijus, I just don't, I just didn't draw. Hmm. Are you gonna allow me to add it to my hand? This feels like bait. I did top deck a good card. You did? I did, but you'll have to find out. Oh man. That's all I'm saying, that's all I'm saying, that's all I'm saying, Joe. I have to do this. I have to because if you activate invocation, I cannot negate it, I think. Wait, can I? Yeah, no, no I magical can't negate meltdown, it. Mate, yeah. So you can't negate it. Do I not have something in the graveyard? Yeah, I can do that, right? Where about this other? Please don't have another oh! invocation. Oh, that's not one. No, I re that's what I was saying. I was like hoping to God I drew a kaiju or I drew invocation, but I drew this instead. Set one pass. Okay. We're about to find out if Sacred Phoenix comes back. The overgrown chicken. It's during your standby phase, right? Oh, no, I thought it was during my standby phase, not yours. Oh, hold up. I have it does other... resurrect. No, this is the other one. So we'll have to resolve oh, this thank... first. Thank God. Hmm. Go ahead. Oh, I guess not. Jeez. I can negate that set card. Worst case scenario. Hmm? <laughs> oh, you're gonna add you're gonna discard Herald to add the rit to add the ritual or ritual spell on you. Either that, or you're gonna send the Entis to pop a card. One, two. It's one of the two here. It's doing the Entis to pop a card. Okay. What are you gonna pop, Joe? Meltdown's not a threat. Oh, <laughs> but oh, but that card you've just set is Super Polymerization. Fucking pet. I discard my other Alistair. <laughs> It's only field though, right? Hold on, what are you... No, I have to fuse cards that you control. And right so now, Apex have? Avian is the thing I'm scared about. Hmm. Double win? Mudguard Dragon. Oh, yeah. I forgot, because you said, like, last duel you didn't have it, so I'm still thinking you didn't have no, no, no. it. <laughs> Different deck. Okay. Right, all three of my Alistairs are in the graveyard. Invocation, I need you right now. Okay. I didn't have I cheated. Seems like I you. don't have an Alistair. <laughs> um, I kind of... Oh, shit. Oh. Here's the thing, I have a lot of cards that are going to screw me if I draw them, but the only thing that's going to save me is if I draw an Alistair, most probably. No, if I draw an Invocation. Okay, so you're in top deck. Do um, I draw invoca Invocation or Bust? Yeah, pretty much. That's what it comes down to. If I draw Invocation, Purgatorio is coming down and I win. 
and you can't negate magic and you can't negate invocation because of magical meltdown. So it's do I draw invocation or do I lose? Actually, Come on, I should have Alistair. I shouldn't have summoned this, but I think I lose regardless. So. Come on, come on! I've worshipped Alistair. Come on, let me draw invocation. How many copies you got? Two. No, not the card. Yes. <laughs> Congratulations, you win round one. <laughs> Nothing, brick. I drew relinquished. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Hmm. I'm thinking same kind of. Wait, what? Uh, excuse me, sir, sir. What's up? My card does not trigger. What is this game? What is this game? Ash Blossom? No, something else. <laughs> and they do not trigger. What is this game? Droll and Lockbird. <laughs> <laughs> I wish. <laughs> Some more group uh, Nexus, oh god. Hmm. Okay. Wait, diagram? Oh that's pretty cool. That's pretty clever. You're not running VFD, are you? <laughs> oh. Yeah, I don't know why Ash Blossom didn't trigger, but it didn't last time, I don't know why. Pre-break preparation of rice apparently can't can't be ash blossomed. I don't even know why I'm making this play right now. This is kind of scary. Well, he's summoning a monster just so I can steal it. Yeah, exactly. That's like not a good idea. Oh, I wouldn't have done that because now you're using a ritual for a ritual. No, no, no. I'm not. It's not mandatory. No, what I mean is, it's like, you, you could have got the pot, as well, man. Oh, yeah. Okay. Yeah, the True King Field spell, it's great, because it just... You can destroy one card in your hand, or field for free. And you add a true king, which basically equals VFD. So, not only does that field spell pop all your true kings like this, like this true, like this card's really great, because look, it just adds another true king. If Joe gets two true kings on the field, I've lost. I can't out VFD. How do you out VFD? It's the reason why Virtual World freaking love it. They run that? I don't know. I, I don't keep up with the TCG or OCG, whatever. Oh, I always keep up with the T with the TCG. Yeah, Virtual World is basically Joe um, Calamity's Turbo. Oh, jeez. It can summon one VFD every turn, if not two. Okay, so can you imagine summoning two VFDs in a turn? You'd be like, yeah, even if you're out one, there's still another. Blue Eyes can't make VFD. Unless you've got something else to increase its level by one. Oh, you're destroying that thing that resurrects in the graveyards now. You're piloting this deck a lot better than I could. <laughs> it's it's not too complex, but um, I'm kind of regretting setting up like this. I guess relinquished. All right, what do we got here? I so should have gone Vandreds. Um, decisions, decisions. I want to know, this game crashes on me when you break. And when you're winning, it doesn't crash. It hasn't crashed for me, like, at all recently. 
Ah, screw it. That way, if you steal Appaloosa, you don't get attack points. Do you? Yeah, but at least I can stop him from negate. Actually, no, because then, because no, but I can't steal Appaloosa because you'll just negate the effect. So, say I summon Relinquish Adam the next day, Appaloosa's Link, you'll just negate it. Yeah. Oh, you would also need um, Illusionist. Oh, but there is one thing you can't stop. Please don't hit me with Magical that. Magical Meltdown. I can add Alistair to my hand. He's ready and primed. If you got that excited, that means you already got Invocation. No, no, no I've got something better. <laughs> right. I'm going to discard Magician Souls and play Apprentice Illusion Magician. Oh, jeez. Alistair, aim for the Invocation. Wait. And if you and if you negate it, that means Apple Apple loses negate loses attack points, and I can attack over it. Yeah. And also, I can do some other shit as well. I'll risk right, it. Right now, I can attack over you. So that's great. That's great. That's great. That's great. So. Oh. To be honest, I wanted you. I wanted you to trigger a monster. Oh no! Wait, shit! What am I doing? <laughs> I'm just free! I'm just free! <laughs> I'm just free! Oh, shit. Oh. What the just <laughs> I didn't mean to do that! <laughs> oh, I fucking hate it when I think two steps ahead of my brain. Tragic. Oh, I did not mean to do that. Tragic. He had the plan all laid out, too. He said, I'm going to swing over Appaloosa now that her attack points are lower. <laughs> oh, man. I hate it and my brain is two seconds ahead of my hands. Oh, at least it's less than just make Appaloosa for... Let's just weaken Appaloosa. I almost negated that. <laughs> <laughs> you more <almost> negate. <laughs> there we go. That's the negation target. <laughs> you could have negated both. I know. I just <laughs> instant fusion. Ooh. I can't believe I did this. So you win because I missed. <laughs> Phoenix comes back oh, too. I love, I love this game. I love this game. <laughs> this is why this game needs a reverse function. I meant to attack and then link. I say, my brain was ahead of my hands. Oh, can I get some reps? Can I get some reps? I did not mean to do that. Oh, it's only enough this card. Sheesh. That's fine. Whatever. Ah, oh, I deserve to lose this. Go for it. I deserve to lose. Yeah, let's get some rips in this shot. I deserve to lose this. I can't even see YouTube chat, so... <laughs> God. Everyone's like smooth brainy here. <laughs> That's funny. I don't run the link three enough to this because I like I thought it was bad. It's really bad. Yeah. I think last I year I had a chance thing. to make like a two ritual uh, link three. If, if and there's a big if I survive this turn, I doubt I'm going to. No, I'm definitely not letting you.
So the main thing with this deck that like really gets popping is like if you could summon a level two, you could summon like four monsters to the field. Or get a link four at the minimum. Yeah. Mate, I just my DeRozan is I deserve to lose this. I need to you know next time I draw you, Joe, I just need to just for the love of God think my plays through. <laughs> Think him through. There's no timer for this reason. <laughs> that just adds back to hand, right? Yeah, it does. Yeah, but now, now I have it. the, the wind mosses on the field. Yeah. And in the graveyard as well. Oh, no. Oh, no. That, no. Sorry, that's Tempest. That's not this. Oh, oh. that gives you the game. What? What? And relinquish fusion! <laughs> Glad I made it for the smooth braining. Wow, guys. Right, Joe, if I make it through this turn... Oh my god, you know what you could do? Have you got Herald of the Arc Light in this deck? I do, yeah. So part Are you going to make Herald? Yeah, part of the combos is making Herald and then like uh, linking it away or doing or just saving it as a negate in general. Yeah, exactly. Just save it as the negate for the Omnigate. There is legit nothing I can do to win this now. Yeah, bow sword. Yeah, I lose. I I deserve to lose this. <laughs> <laughs> I had I had the out apple loser. I just didn't do it. Oh. Damn, that was oh. tragic. Yeah, I tunnel. This is exactly what Moe just said. That that feeling of just tunnel visualing and just not even thinking. He got too focused on how he was gonna like beat me. Yeah, I had the. I basically was focused on how to do it. I just didn't execute it. Oh, I say well played, but I don't deserve that. I took a gamble too, going first. Summoning all those monsters. Well, 